Hey guys, I've got the list. Quentin Tarantino's top 10 movies of 2013. But first today's video. Kevin oh, Pierce, three, raised on maple syrup, two. sharp cheddar, weaned on the hills of Vermont. This guy right here is slaying yeah. it. It's cool to have people saying that you're an Olympic hopeful. The new 22 foot half pipes have changed the way we get to snowboard. Kevin Pierce he has given Sean White a run for his money. This is not Sean White, but Kevin Pierce might be just as good. We share the same talent. It's such an exciting time for us. Road to Vancouver right now. This is the road. Your nickname, Cav? You don't? Because Pete. How are you? Hey everyone, thanks for all your support. I'm doing better. I still want a snowboard. You actually could die. We look at it as trust. We look at it as risk. Now, it's really hard to understand why I would ever want to get back on a board after what I've been through unless it's you really understood the feeling I had for snowboarding. Snowboarding is my true love. I feel 100% confident. No, I, I just don't want any time. The only way to be successful in that sport is to push the limit. Everybody's having bad falls. It doesn't come without injury. I'm 24 years old right now and I've broken, you know, 23 bones. Quentin Tarantino has taken to publicly publishing a list of his top 10 movies from each year and has released a list of his 10 favorite films. There's a surprising number of big popcorn blockbusters here. Here's the filmmaker's full roster so far. Afternoon Delight by Jill Solway, Before Midnight by Richard Linklater, Blue Jasmine by Woody Allen, The Conjuring by James Wan, Drinking Buddies by Joe Swanberg, Francis Ha by Noah Baumbach, Gravity by Alfonso Cuaron, Kick-Ass 2 by Jeff Wadlow, The Lone Ranger by Gore Van Bisky, and This is the End by Seth Rogen Evan Goldberg. So, what do you think? Tarantino has promised an updated version of the list over the next few months when more Oscar contenders join the mix, so stay tuned for that. Thanks for watching. Follow us on Twitter at FilmIsNow and see you next time.